Right, hello and welcome. This is Photoshop CS3. I'm just going to give you a crash course in Photoshop using some of uh, the tools that I've um, learned. Um, I'm doing a screen capture on the Macintosh. You go to the Adobe icon from the Applications window on the Mac, and then you double click on those um, the blue icon and then you can open up Photoshop. So Photoshop is already opened here and let's get um, going with that. Okay, right, so with Photoshop, um, you're going to see on the top left-hand corner the, all the options like File, Save, Open, Import, and things like that. And then you've got an option here called the Edit, which uh, includes the Cut, Copy, Paste, and also the Transform options and the Keyboard Shortcuts and Preferences and the Menu options. Within the image, this is where you make all the changes to the image, like resizing it, adjusting the colors, and cropping it. Then these are all the layer adjustments that you can do, adding new layer, fill the layer, so forth. Once you've done selections, you can either um, select all of it, inverse it, deselect it, or uh, allow you to um, do a selection by color range and you can also grow and transform the selections. Filters. Filters is the thing that um, allows you to add filters on top of pictures in order to create special effects and change the way the picture looks. Analysis is all the extra tools like the ruler tool, counting tool and so forth. View is the mode for checking your um, color is calibrated for CMYK or for the monitor and then you've got the different um, rulers and guides that you can use. Window allows you to see all the different workspaces and you can save these workspaces and all the actions, the brushes and shortcuts are all presented here. The shortcuts are these keys on the Apple. It's the Apple and F9 and by pressing F5 you'll get the brushes tool and so forth. On the far left hand side you've got the um, Photoshop toolbar and this is probably the most important one and you've got a, um, a click with the little left uh, button um, that you click Obviously, most of the uh, Apple and Macintosh products don't have a right-click, but if you've got a right-click button like I have, um, it allows you to toggle this. This basically allows you to see all the different tools. If you hover right in the middle of it and then wait about four or five seconds, you should then see what the tool is. So if I wait here for one, two, there you go. Move tool, that's the move tool. That's the lasso tool. So if I point right into the middle, lasso tool, the quick uh, selection, and so forth. I'll be going over that in a minute. And this is the different change screen modes. You've got standard uh, screen modes, maximize. And some of these options have even more options. And that's where you click that little triangle at the bottom right. If it's got a triangle there, that means there's even more options. And if you press the left click and hold it, you can then select all of that. So let's just um, start you off. And on the right, you've got all the other options which allow you to zoom in, zoom out on pictures. You can have your actions and the tool settings, which are the same ones which you got up here. Um, you've got the color swatches and the different 
colors that you can set for the RGB depending on what you're using. Options are all set here, so if you need it, you can. And layers and channels are selected here. Right, all of that will mean a lot until we start looking at opening up a picture and see what happens. Okay, so I'll see you on the next chapter.